I'm Anil Kumar and here is an excellent question. Multiple choice coordinate geometry, grade 10. The question here is, find a point on y-axis that is equidistant from minus 5 minus 2 and 3 comma 2. You are given four different choices. I'd like you to pause the video and solve the question. Then look into my suggestion. So what we can do here is, let me first give you a sketch so that things are very clear to you what we're trying to do here. It's a very rough sketch, but it gives us fairly good idea about how the things can be. We are given two points here. The first one is minus 5 minus 2. Let's say this point is kind of here, right? And the second one is 3, 2. So it is 3 and 2. So let's say somewhere here, right? So if we join this, we get our line segment. Now the question is, find a point on y-axis that is equidistant from these points. Now how do you find it? So first and foremost, we need to find the midpoint, right? If a point on y-axis is equidistant, then it has to be on right bisector of this segment, right? So, and then we'll have to find the right bisector wherever this right bisector intersects the y-axis that is the point of our interest correct so that is the strategy so what we are given here is we are given these two points minus 5 minus 2 and 3 2 from these two points we can find the midpoint m right midpoint will be what midpoint will be average of x values which is 3 minus 5 over 2 and 2 minus 2 over 2 right so that midpoint is indeed minus 1 0 so midpoint is minus 1 0 so basically it was on the x-intercept so my drawing is not that accurate so this point is midpoint right? okay anyway now the right bisector will be perpendicular to this line segment so what is the slope of this line segment slope of the line segment is y2 minus y1 that is 2 minus minus 2 divided by x2 minus x1 3 minus minus 5 which gives us 4 over 8 right or half so slope of the right bisector will be how much right bisector will be minus 2 right so slope of right bisector will be negative reciprocal minus 2 right so that is the slope of the right bisector and it passes through the point minus 1, 0. We need to find the y-intercept. That is the point on the y-axis. So we can write down the equation in the form of y equals to mx plus b as y equals to slope is minus 2 x plus b. And since we know that the midpoint m is minus 1 and 0, We'll substitute minus 1 for x and 0 for y. y 0 minus 1 minus minus 1 plus b. And that gives us the value of b. So from here, this is plus 2 and we get minus 2 as equals to b. So this point is minus 2 for us, right? So minus 2, 0. Sorry, y value is minus 2. So I should write 0 minus 2 right so y value is minus 2 for us so that is how we can find the y the point on y axis which is same distance away from the given two endpoints i hope you understand and appreciate the method right so that is one way of doing it alternate way could be that we could assume the point on the y axis to be 0 b right so that is a point on the y-axis and we can find distance between these two points right so you can use the distance formula distance between these two points from here should be same equating that distance will get the value of b so that is the second approach which i have discussed in a similar question in another video you can look into that also so these are two approaches which you could follow to answer this question i hope that helps thank you